Number 1. City Museum. Housed in the former International Shoe Building, the enormous 600,000 square foot city. Lewis City Museum is more of an adult sized playground than a standard museum. Visitors are encouraged to climb on and play in the various exhibits. Number 2. Venice Cafe. The beauty that Venice Cafe alludes to, concentrated, vivid, and frenetic, swarms the property, both inside and out. The patio is filled with cement statues covered in tiles, and a collection of artwork created by Lockheed himself is visible through the window. Number 3. Lemp Mansion. The story of the Lemp Mansion runs hand in hand with the story of German immigration and beer brewing in Ste. Louis. Johann Adam Lemp, a German immigrant, moved to Ste. Louis in 1838 and set up a grocery store in South Ste. Louis. Number 4. Grant's Farm. Belonging to the former beer brewing Bush family, Grant's Farm is a 281-acre historical estate located just south of Ste. Lewis and is best known for housing more than 900 animals of over 100 different species, including buffalo, deer, lemurs, ostriches, and camels. Number 5. Chuck Berry's House. This is the house where Chuck Berry lived from 1950 to 1958. A faint before Berry can still be seen on the awning over the front porch. Barry remodeled the basement and added a few rooms onto the back of the narrow house while he lived there. Number 6. World Chess Hall of Fame. The WCHOF is the only institution of its kind and managed by the United States Chess Trust. It opened here in the Central West End neighborhood in 2011. Its permanent collection includes a book of chess openings signed by Bobby Fischer, a 500-year-old Senate piece. Number 7. Bell Fountain Cemetery. More than one pilgrim has been observed leaving a cold one at the graves and mausolea of the estate. Lewis Beer pioneers laid to rest at Bell Fountain Cemetery. Members of beer dynasties like the Anheuser, Bush, and Lemp families are buried in the beautiful 314-acre landscape next to the Mississippi River. Number 8. Fort Bellefontaine. Fort Bellefontaine was built immediately after the Louisiana Purchase was signed. Its position, being north of the new city, Ste. Louis, allowed the fort to protect the gateway to the west. Number 9. The Lemp Family Tomb. The Lemp family is probably one of the most prestigious American families you've never heard of. The hard-working German immigrants made their fortune as beer brewers in 19th century Ste. Lewis alongside, and in competition with, the Anheuser-Busch family of Budweiser fame. Number 10. Cotton Belt Freight Depot. The Cotton Belt Freight Depot was a key link in a cotton trade route that ran through Texas, Arkansas, and Missouri. Built in 1911, the depot served the then-booming cotton industry for decades. Hope you like this video. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel.